I feel like this camera keeps going in and out of focus every time I speak. You guys, I'm back! I haven't made a video in like three months. I haven't been sitting in front of a camera for like three months. Hi guys, it's Emma here and I'm back. Guys, don't worry, I'm back. Videos, I feel up to editing and up to filming and up to being back on the internet. So I've been gone for the past three months and you guys are probably wondering what the heck has she been doing? So I thought I'd tell you guys some stuff I did while I was gone. I started school. I am a freshman in high school now. Um, I don't know if you guys knew that already, but if you didn't, now you know. And all those videos that were like before like August 20th or whatever, they were, or after, they were all pre-recorded. The reason why I was off of YouTube for two months, I haven't filmed for two months, was because I had no motivation to edit, no motivation to film. I just kind of lost interest in this whole YouTubing thing, I guess. I didn't make a video about this. I posted it on my Instagram story because I didn't feel like this deserved a full video because I didn't know how long I was going to be gone for. And it obviously wasn't too long, but it's, it felt like a long time. Maybe like about like a week ago or something, I was like, oh, I really miss filming videos. Maybe I should get back to it. I'm going to start filming again, so it's all good, guys. I filmed like four or five vlogs that I just haven't decided to put out yet and or edit and I kind of just deleted all the footage. I vlogged my trip to, um, where did I go again? I'll put it in right here, like a picture of me or something. Yeah, the Alpine Slope was pretty fun. Yeah, I vlogged all that stuff, but then I just decided to delete it because I didn't like it very much. So I was like, okay, well, what are you going to do now, Emma? You have no videos. And you literally ask people for feedback on your channel and like all your videos and whatever, but you're not literally not doing anything. Yeah, I don't know either, but you know I'm back, so it's all good. My hair has grown like a good amount of length. It used to be like up here, and now it's like down here, and I'm really happy. I like my short hair, but like I kind of miss my long hair. Like I can't run my hands through my hair, like whatever. I can't braid it. I tried braiding my hair this morning, and it was like you could only braid it back. This camera can film 720, I think maybe even up to 1080p, but the editing software I use is very old. It's Adobe Premiere Elements 9, and it won't export in high quality, so that's why my all my videos look really bad quality. I'm hoping to get something like can use Christmas or birthday money or whatever for a new editing software. Oh yeah, it was my birthday on October 30th. Um, cool, yeah. So I'm 15 now. Anime recommendation. The animes I've watched so far was like 37 episodes of Fairy Tale, the first season of Noragami, Aran High School Host Club. I've watched Erased, which is really, really good. I just finished it maybe an hour ago. And I just started watching Yuri on Ice. So anime that I'm watching. I'm going to be watching free over the, this Thanksgiving break. If you guys have any other ones that you suggest, leave them to me in the comments down below. I have gotten really into nail polish stuff. Now, I have a friend, her name's Caroline, and we're planning to do a special video sometime soon on the channel that has to do with nail polish. But I have become extremely into like nail polish and nail art and whatever, and I have been painting my nails like crazy that I'm surprised I haven't died from the intoxicating fumes. So these are my nails right now. They're just black and have like neon triangles and whatever on them. They may look good from afar, but if you bring them up close, they look really, really bad. And I'm, I'm just like learning and whatever, so yeah, there's my light down there because you know I suck at lighting and stuff. So yeah, this is my nail polish collection right now. Uh, these are all my personal nail polishes. I have a bunch of other ones in my bathroom that I share with my sister. And then I have a bunch of like nail art. Ah! I have some like nail art stuff and whatever. Just ignore the me messiness here. Oh yeah, also, I am got Christmas lights. They're little like little ornament kind of things. So I'm like really, really excited for Christmas. Now don't get me wrong, like it's not like I'm like usually like, ugh, Christmas, bah humbug. This year I am 100% hyped for it and I don't have any clue why. I love Christmas. So much. I'm not sure if I said this before, but I have an aversion to waking up to Christmas music. I don't know, there's just something about it. I just cannot wake up and be good for the day listening to Christmas music when I wake up. I'm not sure, but yeah, that's the only thing that kind of knocks me on Christmas. Yeah, I've been wearing a lot of flannels recently. I am a big fan of flannels. They are so nice, so comfortable, and 
and I don't know, I just love them. I have like four or five of them. Also, I went to the Troy Sivan concert in the Suburbia Tour. It was so lit. Oh my god. Let me tell you something. So, I got really anxious because I thought my mom said that we had an hour still to go when that the show started in like an hour. And she actually said half an hour and I started freaking out. I was like, oh my god, I'm gonna miss Astrid. I already missed Astrid. We're gonna miss Troy. And I started freaking out. But it was all good because Astrid hadn't even started until like 7.30, which is when the concert for like when Troy actually started performing was like actually supposed to start. And also when we were doing it, um, he asked fans, some he asked the fans to borrow someone's phone. Because he didn't have his on stage. So he's like, oh yeah, can I borrow someone's phone? So people, they kind of just threw their phone up on stage, they're like, oh my god! And like, there was maybe 10, 15 phones being launched at Troy, and he was just kind of like, oh my god, he's like, you guys gotta crack your phone, stop throwing that at me! Yeah, but then he had, he took this picture, so this picture's my current lock screen, it's a picture he took on someone else's phone, uh, I think it's like Trilogy Savant. Yeah, so shout out to Ariana for having that be taken on her phone. I would honestly die if any celebrity took a photo on my phone, and he also took this video. And yeah, it was super loud, but I was so happy, and it was so amazing, it was a great night, thank you Troy Sivan and Astrid, not like, gonna watch this, but, you know, what if you do? So, he didn't play swimming pools, unfortunately, because he was only playing in cities he hadn't been touring in before, so like Kansas City, I think St. Louis maybe, I'm not sure. I watched some videos on Twitter, and it was so great, hashtag justice for swimming pools, um, yeah, I can't play in Halloween costume, literally a half an hour before I was supposed to leave for my friend's Halloween party, I was still trying to put together my costume. Another thing, I don't know if you guys know this, but I really like rings. And these are my hands with all of my rings on. Oh shoot. These are my hands with all my rings on them. Um, I'm gonna count them and see how many I have. 37 rings on my fingers. But uh, yeah, that's it, I think, for all the updates. I think you guys are up to date on my life right now. Yeah, that will be it for this week's video, guys. Yeah, I'm back, and I'm better than ever still. So. Well, I promise to have weekly videos out for you guys. And my upload days are going to change, Mondays to Thursdays. I will see you guys next week. Have a fabulous day. Bye.